You've stated that global economic prospects are improving in 2015, but with divergent trends. Uh, which regions do you see leading growth and which nations may lag? We do expect growth to pick up from about 2.6% in 2014 to 3% in 2015 and further in 2017 and 16. The, the US is clearly on, on the track to a robust recovery. Labor markets are improving, the housing market is helping. So with the US recovery, its trading partners will obviously benefit. That includes Mexico prominently. But among developing countries also, we see some bright spots. For example, reform-minded governments are in Mexico and in India. And for them, we have fairly robust growth forecasts also, as we expect confidence from these reforms to lift investment, uh, investment climate and support activity. OK, so what's your outlook on crude? Are uh, crude oil prices below $50 a barrel sustainable? And how do you see lower crude prices impacting global growth? Yeah, crude prices have dropped by half since January. We expect soft prices to persist through much of 2015 and 16. Actually, for the near term, we expect prices to remain low. That will, of course, support global growth. But what it will also do, it will reduce global inflation. We estimate on the order of 0.4 to 0.9 percentage point in 2015 and 16 over the course of two years. The extent to which it reduces inflation in, in each country really depends on country-specific circumstances. It depends on other factors like depreciation or to what extent oil price changes are buffered by subsidies, for example.